Well, a very, very warm welcome to you on what is, of course, a truly special day in this part of the world. It is Derby Day. A rivalry so deeply entrenched into the history of sport in this land. It divides opinions, it divides families, it divides just about anything that can be divided. The game itself lasts just 90 minutes, but its repercussions can be felt for months and years ahead. This is one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. Friendly in theory, but we are expecting this to be fiercely contested. Well, in games of this nature, as a player, Peter, you only want to work as hard as demanded. You don't want to have to go at it full pelt. But when the opposition is what it is, all of that kind of goes out the window. The challenge here will ask more of you, and so both teams will, will wish to, to give more than they take. It's one of those games, Peter, where if the opposition increase their effort, you have to follow it. The game itself lasts just 90 minutes, but its repercussions can be felt for months and years ahead. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. Well, this is a friendly, but a friendly only occasion until the word pride gets a mention. And it's likely to have quite a big say between teams that could easily be sucked into an excuse for another feud. Why let an exhibition match get in the way of that? So these two will be going at it very, very strongly. The action has already started. Has a swing at it! They've scored! And some of the best managers I played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. The first touch was absolutely heavenly, and because of it, the finish was a mere formality. Barcelona have an early lead. Good start. Now it's Piatti. Perez played out to the right. He's got away. Titi playing full. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what are they trying to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. That's a look and plays it in. Ball through needs to be good here. Messi. That wasn't easy. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Dada. Lopez. Nothing wrong with that tackle. Ball won cleanly. Cuts it out. Keeper goes long. Decent looking ball. It's Pietti! And in it goes! Well, that's something that will make the manager proud because they dug in deep then and they've got their leveller. Pietti with the smoothest one-on-one -on -one finish. He is one very cool customer. Oh, that's excellent composure because the keeper put as much pressure on as he could by not committing sooner. That has added a whole new complexion to the game. Look, get your seatbelts on because this is showing all the signs of another roller coaster ride. Jordi Alba. Oh, good ball. Suarez plays it out to the wing. Now it's Vidal. Vidal! Oh, great save, real class. Vidal sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. More than happy to take the muscular approach. It's good 
progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? It's got through to him. He's face to face. And Vidal! Goal! Barcelona are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Barcelona. And the whistle goes for half-time. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. Well, it remains very delicately poised and based on the, the promise we've seen through the first 45 minutes, I wouldn't be surprised if this takes another twist or two. It certainly would be in keeping. Very little in it. The score at half-time is two goals to one. So we're just settling back into this second half. And it's messy. Forward it goes. And it's Leo Baptistao. Now it's Perez. Going for it's Perez! Semedo boots it to safety. There are a few waiting for it. Piazza. Leo! He scored! And the second half is off to a flyer! A deflection may or may not have made a difference. Little matter, it is his. Well, it's an inspired substitution. Terrific move by the boss. Well, the instruction from the manager would have been go on and make yourself a nuisance and see if you can snatch a goal. Mission accomplished. Quite a thriller this one's become. Well, look, Peter, who knows what's about to happen from here. Uh, I doubt this will be the final score, though. Jordi Alba. Coutinho looking as though he's being given special treatment here. Treatment he could well do without. Yeah, and having played his part in the goal... And header! In for the follow-up! Goal! Barcelona! And they've got their lead back. And however many surrounded him, that is what he can do. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a needle the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of, now you've got him, now you don't. Brilliant. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. Listen, when it comes to goals, Peter, in this team, he's always the number one contender, and he's done it again. Plays it through. Goes back. And he's there to hoof it away. Espanyol are definitely going about this the right way. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. Javi Lopez. Perez. Top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Well positioned to make that interception. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Semedo, he's onside. Messi. Messi! That would have been game, set and match. Yeah, he knew only too well that to concede then would have been tough to recover from. That could prove a big moment in this game. And it's Rakitic. Now it's Messi. Rakitic. He's got away. It's Rakitic! Away from immediate danger. Barcelona certainly don't need to overcommit now. Their priority lies further back. Vital. There is the final whistle. Barcelona have held on. A knife-edge game, a single goal margin, but they have won it. 
So there it is. What struck you most about that? Barcelona made their intentions clear that nothing else...